It's time to enter the proliferation. Now, I said this a while ago because I've been healing as I've been going. I don't wait. I just show y'all every fucking step of the way. And that's why y'all are going to really start to learn and appreciate what the fuck I do. Like I said, a while ago, I put out a video. I remember this one so clearly. I said, heal yourself so that you can reveal yourself. You feel me? Whatever you are, your world is yours. Since 2020, since the beginning of COVID, where I decided to become 100% sober, when I decided to fully just let my energy be what it was and fully let my, my soul shine through, this has all been a regeneration phase. I'm gonna say that again. This has all been a regeneration phase. I've been actually healing myself from all the damage, all the trauma, all the self-inflicted injury, my cellular self, my spiritual self, my emotional self, my mental self, Every chakra, my heart, my mind, my third eye clarified, my crown back on my head, my voice being spoken, my heart filled and just living out that outpour of just straight courage and love, my willpower, my solar plexus, my creative juices, the books are out, these energy, these videos, you know what I'm saying, my root chakra, getting my situation right, getting my money right. This has all been the regeneration phase. And now that we've gotten past the regeneration phase that had coming through the battles and the scars and we've recovered. Now we truly enter the high, the highlighted, the heightened proliferation phase. Do you understand what that means? The proliferation, prolific, to be bountiful and supplying. Why the BY your world is yours? Y'all already know I've been on that rap shit. Y'all already know I've been one of the most legendary rappers in the game. Y'all already know I studied under the one of the rarest Legendary rawest rappers in the game, Lil B, the bass guy, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, maybe plus tracks. You know what I'm saying? Most tracks in the rap game. You know, we ain't never give a fuck. We just let that shit fly, whatever you want. You feel me? And, you know, Shiki Sheik dropped that 130 track mixtape, Exodus. If you don't know about that shit, go check that out. That's a historical effort. You know what I'm saying? We got so many bass freestyles, Sheik.bandcamp.com. You could go in there and see every piece of my stream of consciousness as I developed before y'all, a lot of y'all even met me, you feel me? Now, whatever you are, your world is yours. We already been prolific, but it's time to start getting real because I'm going to keep it real, gangster. A lot of y'all niggas don't got no swag, bro. A lot of y'all is just straight corny. A lot of y'all just do fucking push-ups, pull-ups, and dips and shit, and that shit is fucking whack as fuck. Like, y'all don't understand. Like, it's more than just look at me, motherfucker. It's more than just, well, look what I can do. I can do some push-ups. I can do some fucking pull-ups. Ooh, look at my muscles. What the fuck? Whatever you are, your world is yours. How the fuck does that help anybody? You know what I'm saying? Like, all right, great. It's entertaining to a certain degree, but... I'm in the business of swagging motherfuckers' lives up, you feel me? I'm on this planet because I know I got a lot of swag and I know that I have a lot of solutions and I know that I'm really deeply enriched and enlightened mentally and spiritually and I know I have these existential solutions. So I'm here to deliver that so I can free y'all minds. I'm more or less like a mental Harriet Tubman, if you will. I'm here to free the mind slaves, you feel me? And let y'all really enter that what would be called based consciousness, which is being positive and doing you, but hybridized with the YWY, which is the deep science and applied enlightenment, the school of applied enlightenment, you feel me? Then match that with the heart that I got from my GP family. Oh my God, we on a whole different level with it, you feel me? So whatever you are, your world is yours. It's not that I did this shit all by myself. That's far from the truth, you feel me? But this regeneration phase has, I studied under the masters, I studied under the greats, and I've applied it and create my own energy with this shit. And now we're just gonna continuously swag. I love y'all. A lot of y'all are creative as fuck. A lot of y'all wanna make music. A lot of y'all wanna make art. A lot of y'all wanna push fashion. A lot of y'all wanna write. A lot of y'all really wanna get y'all creative energies out there, but y'all not doing it. And I'm gonna tell y'all motherfuckers, please do that shit and do that shit bountifully and prolifically. But first and foremost, Please heal yourself before you do these things. Make sure that you get in that top form. Make sure that you have that physique. Make sure that you have that knowledge. Make sure you have that discipline. Make sure you have that refinement of the soul and the spirit before you start to jump in the game because that's how I lost myself. I didn't have the character development. Yeah. I started in Base World. Yeah, I started in the lunchroom. Then I hopped in the Base World. And I hopped in the Base World. I connected and networked with everybody. Yeah, I ended up being direct, partnered up with Lil B as a, as a mentee. You feel me? Yeah, I was like that. You feel me? But I'm not going to lie. 
if I had better character, everything would have worked out different. But I don't live in regret because we have to go through these rises and these falls. And it's not about the rise and the fall. It's about what you learn in the process and the bounce back. So right now, the redemption is crazy. I'm not looking to beg nobody's friendship or nothing like that. But I'm going to say it like this. At the end of the day, I'm grateful to have had the relationships, the partnerships, and the journey through Base World, my adventures in Base World, and through the ups and the downs. That down, I definitely came back and look at me now, and it's not a flex on nobody. I'm just really grateful to have healed, regenerated, and become my truest, most refined self because I learned my lessons through my karma. I used to tell my coworkers when I used to work at Hudson Jane, I used to tell Jillian, and I used to tell Emla, shout out Jillian and Emla, that I was working myself out of a karmic hole. I fucked my own life up real bad. I fucked people over. I was out here getting in between people and their boyfriends and their girlfriends. You feel me? I was out here sniping niggas bitches. You know what I'm saying? I was out here getting people high. I was out here just, you know, cheating on, on, on my girlfriends. You know what I'm saying? Like, I was doing a lot of sly shit. You feel me? And it wasn't... I just thought that was the right thing to do at the time. You feel me? I thought the world was a fucked up place. I was just a learning. I was a fucked up individual and I learned my lesson. And then I sat down... And I realized there is a higher power at work. There is a higher creative force at work. And that all started when I was in Sudan. And I told you I was tripping them tri the fucking tabs. <laughs> you feel me? And then I heard the Avon at Maghrib. And I said, oh my God, it's really real like that. You feel me? And from there, my whole life since 2017 in, in, in December has always been a journey. 2020 is when I really just peeled back and said, fuck this. If I die, I die. Whatever you want, I have to heal. I have to be my fullest energy. And now we're entering that proliferation phase where now y'all get to really hear the deeper side of my mind. A lot of people would be like, you know, I don't trust an individual without a dark side. I leave all my dark emotions. I leave all of my, how you say, lower frequencies. You know what I'm saying? My disagreeable, like, because I'll really boom a nigga. You feel me? I really slit a motherfucker's throat, bro. I'm really fucked up sometimes. You feel me? I do. I, I'm like I'm like jigsaw a little bit in my head sometimes. You feel me? I'm going to just keep it real. But you can't have that energy out in this street. And that's why base freestyle, water release, all of those outlets, even this, even the workouts, these are ways that we sublimate and we transmute our creature impulses, our lower impulses, and turn that shit into gold. You feel me? Whatever you are, your world is yours. So most of the time, I'm going to say this. Y'all see me moving in my super ego. You know what I'm saying? You could go to my song, Idioms for Idiots. Look up Sheik Mackie, Idioms for Idiots. And then at the end of the video, I have a long message that explains the difference between the id, the ego, and the super ego. Most of y'all, I deliver my super ego. You know what I'm saying? I live and operate from my super ego. I live and operate from my moral conscious self. You feel me? Not that I don't have a midway ego. Not that I don't have an id that will really slap the shit out of a motherfucker or really do some real sadistic shit. It's just, you know that those areas of self tend to be operating from the id is the lowest self. The ego is the midway self, but this, the super ego is just operating from pure instruction, from conscious and moral correctness. You know what I'm saying? And that's always going to be the high road. And that's always going to guarantee that you pursue and, and advance in this life. You feel me? The it ain't going to get you far. You know what I'm saying? The it is the kid. The ego is the, is, the, is the adult. And basically, like, the super ego is the wisdom of the grandparents and the wisdom of the you know, times. You feel me? So whatever you are, your world is yours. I just said a lot, but I just need y'all to know that what has been happening has been the regeneration phase and now we're entering the proliferation phase a lot of these motherfuckers don't got no swag i'm here to help you swag your life up you know what i'm saying you gotta have that physique so that you walk up in the spot you just know that it's, it's on lock you feel me it's no questions like what the fuck yeah he's it you feel me they're it whatever you are she's it you feel me you walk in the spot you know that you just on on point whatever your talent is you a guitar player whatever it is you just got the skill in the bag you feel me whatever your aptitude is you got the skill on 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 sly you feel me so whenever you need to apply yourself you know what i'm saying you already know you're getting that job done at that high level you feel me you valuable you feel me and you just continuously express yourself so many people are just stuck on consume 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 the real individual is going to produce 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 and give and give and give proliferate 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 you feel me whatever you are your world is yours i love y'all so much it's more than fitness with me it's more than some fucking push-ups with me it's more than talking about fucking chakras with me it's everything and everything at the same time it's everything and everything at the same time you feel me everything all things nothing off the table i tell y'all evolution all aspects all areas all planes of existence 
and we're supposed to master this existence. That means we're supposed to learn every aspect, fully comprehend it, fully integrate it, fully become that highest version of ourselves. And I don't denounce shit, you feel me? So as this music starts to drop, you feel me? Y'all gonna get to know me, you feel me? I am human like a motherfucker. But uh, let's have some fun with it, you feel me? Whatever you are, your world is yours. Shouts out to all the supporters. Get in the game, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, you want that joan? Go get that joan. You want to go, you know what I'm saying? Do your thing, do your thing. But rank a thing, you feel me? Hey, man. I love my life. I can't knock it, you feel me? And y'all can't take that from me. Forgive me, everybody, for anybody that I've ever hurt in the past. Um, you know, and if we was all in the mix doing fucked up slash shit, then that's just what we get, right? You know what I'm saying? Let's live, learn, you know what I'm saying, and prosper moving forward. It's really like that. Evolution, only solution. Self-mastery, only success. Discipline, the only freedom. Consider the vibrations raised always and forever, baby.